think I might have emailed him. Yeah, I think we talked on email. Um, and he wrote the stories, you know, um, and I was one of the ones, like, he put a lot of my stories in there, a lot of some of the years, too. It's uh, kind of similar to what you and uh, you and old John were doing with It's a Weird World, where you were up, uh, where you were sending stories to him, and then he'd narrate them. But yeah. when I said yep. something, I don't know, is he doing something now? Like, is he doing it? Is, is, was he doing something? I can't remember what he was doing now. What, Stephen Wagner? Yeah. I don't know. If he's he's doing... doing... He's, um... He's still doing that, the writing those articles for about.com, I think. That was that was where I got that one article about the Hollow Earth and stuff that I, that I gave to Roger. More than mm-hmm. true stories and stuff like that. Because I know the true stories he wrote two books. When I get those, I'll share them with you. They were on Amazon. Like I said, um, yeah, it'd, it'd be cool if we could somehow get him on here. But I mean, it's probably it's probably a big stretch. So, oh, I'm not gonna yeah. hold my breath for it. Uh, it sounds like the, pretty the, old. It's not the, like along the lines of Raymond Moody. He's just out there, you know. I don't think he's famous. Famous. I mean, he, you know, like I said, he's got those books. But the the worst thing he could do is send an email. That that's the yeah. worst thing you can do. You know what I mean? The, the yeah. Like, what actually the worst thing you do is not even try. If you if you don't try, then it's pretty much not worth it. You know what I mean? So if if, if, if you ever. if you think it's a good idea, do it. Yeah, you never know until you try. Yeah. Like, like I asked John about getting back into to doing music and collaborating with him, which I, you know, I didn't know if he was going to wind up having time to do it or not because he's got a lot going on. But right. it never hurts to ask, and you know, now he's starting to get back into it. We yeah. might collaborate, so you never know till you, you know, you, you never know till you try. So I don't know if he's got a show, if he's got like a contact information there. I, I haven't followed up on him or anything. And I know when he I'm, first started doing those stories, him and I were both like, that was all new. That was when kind of people were starting to kind of just get on the internet and do a lot of stuff. So I know, um, you know, that's why he used a lot of my stuff, I bet, and yours. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was the, that was, um, the stories were all through emails. I got a, I got a big stack of, of printouts of almost every story that, that you, you gave to him a while back so that I'm, I'm going to sit down and read through those those will be good topics for like future mystery show episodes and uh, and, and maybe like interviews with Roger and John that's <laughs> why I want to get the book because I bet you he put some of those stories of ours in there because you know we gave him the rights to that yeah um, and because he published so many of ours on, he had like a what was it a week a uh, monthly thing? Austin, we'd go in and like read the true stories, not just ours, but everybody's. You know, he'd have remember it. if it was monthly or if it was weekly or I think, I think he monthly. yeah, because he had a huge publication. He'd have just like shit tons of stories on there. So I think it was something he'd spend a whole month gathering and putting together, and then at, at the end of each month he'd release his stories that he had chosen well yeah. so now they're in those books so that's why i want to get those and I, I need to get it back into amazon put those on my cart because i kind of forgot about that but and know. now he does um now he writes or at least the last few years he's written articles on about.com that's where i got that one he, he writes about anything and everything supernatural and paranormal along the lines of, of what we discuss uh, okay but I mean, get, getting him on here that'd be that'd be badass. But yeah, it'll, it'll be it'll be a work in progress. When I get the books, maybe there'll be something in there about like how you can contact. Him. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I I tried to look up like a YouTube channel for him, but he doesn't have one. His, his he just has stories and research he's done featured on a, a few different channels, but no no channel. Of his those stories, gosh, that must have been back in the was it the nineties? Yeah. Now a lot yeah. of writers go go towards the podcast area, so yeah, it's probably he's done some of that. It's that probably the, that's this probably the best way to find him. 
yeah, this was before all that went, you know, and, and people were kind of getting out there and doing, uh... No, I mean, I'm, I'm serious. Yeah. Even journalists, they, they do podcasts before they do a YouTube video. Like, they, it's popular among writers. They, they would rather do a podcast. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, like, they don't want anything to do with, like, actual videos like we're doing. Like, uh, um, well, Michael Paul, he's a good example. He, he, he had his podcast going out, and he doesn't even have a channel, I don't think. So. You know. You know, you watch YouTube now, and it's just stupid stuff. I swear, it's just, some of it, they just put anything on there. I know. I mean, you are the, on there. Yeah, but no, you know, some of it's just real stupid. Like, they can go on there and say, like, I don't know if you knew about that guy named Twitch that killed himself. They're going on there saying that his wife killed him now, and it's obvious. I mean, it's obvious. I think he killed. He, he committed suicide. Yeah. So there's all these conspiracy theories on there about this poor lady. I mean, she's a widow now with three his kids and. There's people no, on there that uh, not liable for anything they say. There's no, they don't have to prove it or anything on there. You got those people on there that say that everything's a conspiracy. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, they said that about Ellen too. You know, because she had three people that she knew that died in within three months. But heck, the one was her ex-girlfriend she hadn't seen in like twelve years or something. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Twitch was actually one of her friends that had killed himself. He was one, and then some little, that little southern guy used to be on her show. I don't know if you guys ever watched it, but yeah. No, we we, we uh, don't watch Ellen. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't know why my friend was watching it, and I was like, "What?" I think he watched it because of Twitch. Twitch was a black dancer on there. Uh huh. Okay, so do you, you want to do this before she gets really, really out of control? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Austin. Uh, you you, you, you want to you wanna talk about the, what was it, the caverns? or no? Yeah, it was the, the caverns not being discovered. Or Austin's got to work. Be, no. Being discovered and not being uh, created. You, you mentioned uh, you, you mentioned that uh, that uh, it, that what was it that, that they were they natural or were were they actually when they found them were they natural or were they already yeah were they natural or were they were they artificially created yeah 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 okay I'm coming right. <laughs> no. So if you yeah, want, that's if you want, we can get that last part right there. Just uh, go silent and then then say that last part as much as you want, and then then we'll be done with all that. Okay. Um. So we were. That was the only thing I could really think of based off of what you said was whether the was I need to look into whether the caverns are, are were perhaps artificial or were created and if if they were artificially created if so maybe by who but that's something I need to do research in into um, you touched you touched on a lot of this the, a lot of the stuff I did so so right now I don't have any more to add to that just yet but we both did pretty good on that yeah so just um, let me know, and then I'll say, I'll finish this real quick. Now I gotta take my dog out. <laughs> All right, so go silent and just say that part, and you're good. That's it. All right, so that right there <laughs> is that. That's what it is. Because a lot of your stuff, man, I, 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 I really don't have anything to say. That's pretty much everything that I've learned to when it comes to it. Um, and like the books, I'd really like to eventually get into the reference books that I mentioned down at the bottom part, the ones that was mentioned in a lot of the information. You know. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna read over those articles I've sent you and that we've shared, and just take notes on the highlights of them. That'll be another thing I do. So. Yeah. 
like on here it says Agar Agartha secrets of the subterranean cities and then the deep dwellers <clears throat> sorry the deep dwellers and then uh, Chronicles of Akakor and the visitors those those are the ones that I really want to dive into kind of get a better feel of the stories you know because I, 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 from everything I've seen and I've heard in these stories, these this is the the cream of the crop right here. This is what people want to hear, but they don't hear too much of. So, I really do want to be able to kind of get more into that whole area. Okay, we'll we'll add to our outline going forward. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, man. So, uh, before we go, we've got to ask your mom, what do you think of it so far? Sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, All right. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah. You it, though? What did you say you were going to start doing it? Uh, we are going to get this together, and hopefully, if we can get Robot to recuperate from his whatever vacation he's on <laughs> then uh we should have it out at least by april i'm hoping april so because i'd like to have this going um at least the first episodes or two you know yeah yeah we'll do one more video call here in the next month or so where we we do more of our deep dives into the research and highlights we've done <laughs> mm -hmm. and uh, so. uh like this stuff right here while we're you know the actual discussion on how we're outlining it I, I, I'm wanting to put this on the wow talk too to where people kind of get a behind the scenes of what we're doing you know what I mean but keep it separate yeah. from what we're actually saying in the video so sound good yeah that works alright <laughs> alright All right, I'm going to go get my dog out He's 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 whining for me <laughs> All right, and uh, yeah. I will talk to you guys later. Thanks so much for right. being here. You're welcome. I'm gonna, yeah, thanks for coming. I'm, I'm going to nickname you uh, Troublemaker. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, see, and that's 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 what I I want. I want like a general conversation first yeah. out, out of the gate you know your yeah, yeah. your story on it and everything we can do a deep dive on so many different aspects of this one story there's so much to it it's fucking crazy yeah i know um but i i want to just show the audience uh like maybe like do a little intro about it and mm -hmm. like um show them some of the sources of information that i'm coming from mm -hmm. and um then maybe like next time we can we cover this topic we can dive into the different aspects of it you know yeah once we've read books and stuff sounds like a plan now um it's like, like i said too i want to set it up to where it's more of a mix between documentary and conversation you know what i mean so we'll, we'll have the conversation but we're also going to focus on a documentary style that will switch in between you know from one to the other all so, right so, so we'll, we'll so actually documentary will need a script right <clears throat> yeah and that's what i was saying when we were talking if you want me to i can write up a script for you like you want yeah. and you can well, go through let's, and let's edit. have a little bit of a chat about look, like first and then we'll tease out some of the different topics and stuff and areas we could dive into that's interesting and uh, then we can write the script from there well that's kind of what i'm saying too like actually make uh, powerpoints of what you really want to focus on whenever you want me to pull the information up and get it together so that i can focus on those areas you know mm. for, for casey <laughs> 